Hello, thank you for stopping by. Today we're looking at the Bakta 50 year. This is the Patton Barrel 22. This is a 50 year age statement from 1868 to 1970. Not that much information that I could find online about the bottle, but the thing I really like about this is its wooden box it comes in. Has the company name on front. Doesn't feel like the oak boxes that I've seen. The date at the bottom. Hold together to these two brass hinges. On the back of the box. The little Lock right there. Kind of thing that irritates me though is that there's a scratch right there on the box. I don't know who did that or how it could have been. More like you put it in a place that something could have scratched it. As I open this, kind of reminds me of those old shipping movies where um, those old Indiana Jones movies where you package stuff in a bunch of the the straw and that's how the bottle is this bottle is kind of like the other bottle I looked at the back to 2707 has the age statement right there brandy 50 year back to 50 year 750 milliliters. There's a little tag. I don't know if you can we'll adjust to it. it. Says patent number 22, bottle 500. I don't know if that says 71 or 91. Proof 96.8. The years on it will be 1868. 1885, 1934, 1944, 1956, 1967, and 1970. So I believe all those are poured into this bottle. Then you have the, the straw package. Oh, fell over place. Straw packaging comes in this, has this little book too. That states on the front, right underneath the bumblebee, to read. Read me. Has a picture from the private seller of Peter Bakta, 50 year old brandy, 100% Armiac, finished in Islay whiskey cast, vintages from 1868 to 1970. Your bottle of Bakta, 50 years, born out of. Barrel name Patton, barrel 22, bottled by BD, initials of 71521. And it says, to learn more about the history, uniqueness of the barrel, go to baktabrandy.com. Just go to this bottle. You probably don't like my broken up reading anyway, but it shows... Pictures on one side, story on the other side. For me, I I like stories that go with certain items. I know you don't want to go to like every story you pick a bub like a twelve pack of Coke and it tells you a whole story about you know. But I guess if you're gonna hang around, drink one of these brandies that state that. It's over 50 years old. You kind of want to have a story to tell or have friends look at this while they're reading it. So you're going to slam this whole bottle in one day. So I guess you'll have time to read this little book. And I guess having a story that goes along with a bottle too, you know, it, it intrigues more. It says how to drink it on the rocks or neat. 
go through it some more. I think I missed the, the last, the last pages of it. Oh yeah. The four pillars: rare, exquisite, value, and purpose. This when you're drinking, you write your notes down. What you like about it, I guess. Overall, I really like the way it's packaged. The way that. It has a story behind it. Um, I know a lot of people don't like having stories that goes with their things, but I appreciate you stopping by. Thank you. Hope you have a nice, wonderful, terrific day. Take care of one another. You know, stop by a friend's house, message them, see how they're doing, you know, but take care of yourself first. Make sure to eat and drink some water. Have a wonderful and nice day. And again, thank you for stopping by.